welcome. This is Jeff with North Coast Shooter Supply. This is our next <clears throat> video series on firearms restoration. What we have here in front of us is a Wasser 10 AK style rifle. Clearly it has seen better days. <clears throat> um, there's a multitude of issues. This is the way I received it in the shop. Uh, it's got corrosion issues. Uh, it appears that it was fired <clears throat> to the point where it actually got the wood to start on fire. Got a nylon sling resting across the barrel, which of course melted to the barrel. And um, somebody had put one of these slide fire stocks on it. Um, just a junky piece of crap, to be honest with you. Uh, scope mount on the top cover. Uh, the rifle mechanically, I've gone through it and it is sound, but obviously, much like the Browning High Power video series we did earlier. This rifle, in order to be resale, have any kind of resale value at all, is going to have to be considerably redone. So, <clears throat> that is going to be the next project that we uh, embark on. We're going to dump this stock system completely. Probably end up going, getting a new rail or a new top cover without the, the scope mount on it. And, rehabbing it back to an original configuration, more classic AK style versus the, the modern bolt crap all over AK style. So stay tuned and we'll walk you through the process as we do with the high power. Welcome to the next video in our AK restoration series. <clears throat> As you can see, we've completely blasted the, all the metal parts now in preparation for Duracoat. If you remember, we had a, a black one-piece slide fire type stock on the rifle. It was a, a very shoddy piece of equipment. Go ahead and replace that with a, an original bit of wood. Also, if you remember, the, the forearms were painted black and were really pretty well haggard. We stripped the paint completely off of those. Stained everything a nice dark red color. We've uh, also had to acquire a pistol grip, so we've got a nice plastic brown pistol grip, which will go on after everything gets finished. Still deciding on the paint scheme at this point. Um, thinking it's going to be kind of something unique. So stay tuned, and we'll uh, show you the process in the next video. Thank you very much. <laughs> 